The Convergence and the Event. January 9, 2014. Greetings. We are coming to you with important messages around points of convergence and insight into many things which we know many of you are experiencing. Our scribe has awoken from sleep many a recent morning feeling as if he was rode hard and put away wet. He has proclaimed many times to us, what the hell was that? His dreams have been of incredible length and have seemed more vivid, colorful, emotional and more real than they ever have in this lifetime. We want you to understand that as the veils between dimensions and timelines continue to thin these experiences are to be expected. We are not a council that often speaks of predictions or to give concrete facts based upon earthly experiences. We want your paths to be your own, dear ones and we do not, would not and could not ever trump your choice of free will. We don't want to plant ideas in your head so to speak, but there are some issues which we would like to give clarification on. The dreams that so many of you are experiencing right now in many ways are not dreams in the ways that you think of them. Dreams have been one vehicle for us to send you messages, signs, and for many of you have been a way for your soul or your spirit to travel while you have slept. While this definition of dream still holds true, we will confirm that the dreams that have seemed unique or different indeed are. What many of you have been experiencing is your first glimpse into seeing past lives, alternate realities, and alternate versions of you that all exist simultaneously. We wish not to tie your brain up into knots and we ask that you not go too deeply into letting your rational mind comprehend the concept of time as it exists outside of your earth. But in reality all times and all moments occur simultaneously and parallel to one another. So the dreams in which you see alternate versions of yourself are in fact occurring in alternate realities. Some of these glimpses are being shown to you indeed to give you lessons or insight into your current now. Some of these glimpses are you, viewing an actual ending to a timeline or reality, and other versions of yourself are currently being integrated into your current now on Earth in this moment. We gave this description to our scribe the other day and he said, what the hell does that mean, give me a metaphor please. The best one we could provide him was to consider that many of yourselves are like a set of encyclopedias. For this example consider that this set of books has 50 volumes, and it is as if all 50 books are being integrated into one master book. There are many other versions of yourself that will continue to exist in other, alternate realities, and there are many that have chosen to end their realities and to join you now in this moment on Earth. The reason they have chosen to do this is that the experiences and knowledge and wisdom that they have gained will serve to raise your vibration and will assist you in your continued journey up the spiral in the new fifth dimensional earth. It is as if separate, connected, versions of yourself have all been going to different schools, learning different things and now are coming back to you to bring all they have learned to your now consciousness. We know that many of you will not fully comprehend this in the moment and we say worry not dear ones, the time is approaching soon when you shall fully grasp this concept. This particle integration is now available to you because your physical vessels have been upgraded in a manner that you are now able to house all of this additional information. Many of you are also wondering about the event and we understand the anticipation and yet want to remind you that all is within you dear ones. As everything in this universe is a microcosm or a macrocosm of something else, the event must occur within on an individual scale before it can occur on a larger planetary scale. We remind you that you need not wait for a sign from above, that you need not look to the skies for the proof. For the proof lies and lives within now. Once the awakening of individual souls on this planet has reached a size that can reflect this event on a global scale, it will occur. However one cannot build a larger structure without all of the individual pieces in place. It is our intention with this message to confirm and to continue opening up your minds and your hearts to new ways of thinking and of knowing. We wish not to confuse or confound, and remind you that in moments of doubt or confusion to just go within to the stillness to find the answers that you seek. We love, cherish and honor you. We are jubilant at the work you have done and continue to do. We await the moment soon when we can all come together as a galactic family and celebrate as one. Until that moment, do not waver, do
Do not stop, do not dim your lights. In love and light we leave you. Rejoice. The Lighted Ones. Channeled by Andrew Martin. www.andrewmartinartist.com